13 and a half easy steps for accurate shade selection using the Vita Classical Shade Guide. If you want your restoration to match the color of the surrounding teeth, you need to be able to select the correct shade, record it, and communicate this information to the lab technician. There are three main words you need to know to describe color. Hue. This is the color tone. Green, blue, yellow, orange, etc. are hues. Chroma. Chroma is a saturation or purity of a color. How much red is in this color? The more red, the more chroma the color has. Value. The value of a color describes its relative lightness or darkness. The highest value is pure white. The lowest value is black. The higher the value, the brighter the color. The Vita Classic Shade Guide is arranged alphabetically into four groups according to hue. Orange, yellow, yellow-gray, and brown-gray. Each group is subdivided according to chroma and value. The higher the number, the more chroma the shade tab has. The lower the number, the higher the value of the shade tab and the brighter it appears. For instance, A4 is the shade tab with the lowest value and thus appears darkest. Now to the steps for proper shade selection. Because the human eye is more sensitive to the value of a color, we will rearrange the shade guide according to value. The shade tabs are now B1, A1, B2, D2, A2, C1, C2, D4, A3, D3, B3, A3.5, B4, C3, A4, and C4. B1 has the highest value and lowest chroma. C4 has the lowest value and highest chroma. Step 2. Ask your patient to remove any lipstick or distracting makeup to minimize the contrast effect. Make sure teeth are clean. Perform a quick profi if necessary. Step 4. Raise the chair so your eyes are at tooth level. Step 5. Stand 10 to 14 inches from tooth. Step 6. Use indirect light for shade selection and turn off the unit's light. Using natural sunlight by shade selecting near a window is ideal. Step 7. Fan the shade guide in front of the patient's teeth in an edge-to-edge -edge alignment with the natural teeth. Squint your eyes for a more accurate value perception. Step 9. In this step, you will select the closest two shade tabs in value. Step 10. Don't stare. Make a decision in 5 seconds. Pick the closest two shade tabs from the guide and set them aside. Step 11. Rest your eyes by looking at a neutral color, like gray. This will make your eyes more sensitive to color again. Step 12. Make a decision between the two closest shade tabs you selected. Remember, don't stare and make a decision in 5 seconds. You have now selected the closest general shade of the tooth. Step 13. If the tooth is polychromatic with different shades, record this on a shade map for proper communication to your lab technician. Step 13 and a half. Make sure to involve your patient in the shade selection process and document in the chart. This reduces unnecessary surprises at time of delivery. Good luck.